Good evening. Southern Britain is clearing up after the worst night of storm since records began almost 300 years ago. A crisis meeting of ministers called by the Home Secretary decided the emergency services were coping magnificently. The storm gathers strength, forming itself into a spinning top of turbulence. Midnight, the centre of the storm west of the Channel Islands. The weathermen predicting Britain would miss the worst. But the storms wreaked havoc across the country. The emergency services said they had little or no warning. They, like the rest of the country, were taken completely by surprise. What they did, though, was that a deep depression surrounded by spinning winds that formed in the Bay of Biscay. They said it wouldn't get past the channel, but the gales hit northwest Brittany around 11 o'clock last night and arrived at Dorset and Hampshire around midnight. The worst storms the nation has known for nearly three centuries. They came in from the ocean without any warning from the weathermen. The winds were those of a hurricane. They cut a swathe of destruction from Cornwall to Kent and northwards to London and beyond. The capital and the counties around it were without electric power for hours. Trains were stopped, roads blocked. The emergency services brought every available man and machine into operation. Southern England suffered the full fury.